Good morning, everyone. Today is the 29th of June, 2017. It's a Thursday morning. Market's going to open here in a couple minutes. But we are at the all-time highs once again. And usually we don't trade if we're within 10 points of the all-time highs. So uh, we're within 7 now. Uh, in this particular instance today, there is a massive amount of pressure to the downside. So, if we get down here, 10 points away from the highs, and we're looking like we're going to continue down, I'll be looking for a trade. So let's just wait and see what happens, and uh, see how the, uh, the day unfolds, the morning unfolds. Keep you posted. There's the bell. Market is open. We get down here somewhere in this vicinity. And it looks like we're going to continue down. I'll be looking for a short. But as long as we're up here, I'm not, uh, not interested. Here we go. Here's the beginning of the massive pressure release to the downside. If we get down here, it looks like we're going to continue dropping. I'll jump on the, on the train. Okay, we're down here, but uh, unfortunately we're looking like we're going to push to the upside uh, momentarily. I uh, didn't want to see that. I wanted to see this continuing down. It did not, so I'm uh, holding off on going short. If we break this pivot, uh, here's what I'm talking about. This is the beginning of a pivot up. If we come back down, and break that pivot low, I'll be interested. But right now it looks like it's going to push to the upside a little bit. Why go short if it's going to go up, right? So that's what I'm watching. Okay, here we go. Got a signal to go short. I did. Target's down here. for about five nuggets 85 percent chance my main signal in combination with a few other things was breaking below this area of support uh, so if you notice my entry was right here as soon as we had a bar closing below this pivot I took the initiative and entered for the short uh, statistically We've got an 85% chance of hitting target. Taking advantage of that also. So, let's see what happens here. Hey, this pullback here is perfectly normal. I'm actually looking for an opportunity to add on here. Add it on right here. Got my signal. Here's the target, and it's actually the result of two sources, which makes it even more likely to be respected. For the student's reference, we're dealing with a Plan B and a Plan C combined here. Uh, they're both taking the initiative here, which means it's more likely to be successful uh, because of the two uh, recognized patterns here. Once again, plenty of opportunities to get into this short. This was a little aggressive. This was more conservative, as were these other two pivots. About halfway to targets. Here comes a pretty good impulse down. I see it off in the horizon. Should have a pretty good push down. Hopefully it's going to get really close to targets if not hitting them uh, directly. Beautiful. Beautiful.
I didn't quite push down as far as I was hoping. I was hoping to get down here with this uh, this thrust, but uh, I'll take what I've got. I was expecting to go a little further, but uh, that's okay. Gonna have another impulse down or two. Uh, I might take two impulses to get the target, but uh, I don't think there's going to be a problem. Don't see anything in the uh, horizon here that's going to create an issue. There we go. Now we're on a roll. Another impulse down like we just had. Ought to do it. Covered one here. Looking for the other one to get hit. Awesome. Second one hit. Targets are filled. And I'm going to call it a day here. This was a 85% probability of, of happening, uh, hitting target guys and uh, students, graduates, you know what I'm talking about. You guys have a great weekend. I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.